my goodness. It's me. So I actually never thought I would make one of these videos, like a day in my life type of video because as you can see, yeah, it's just really daily life. Like it's not so glamorous and not anything I thought worth filming, but then I thought, why, why not? Why not? So I'm here with my hair roller in. So now everyone knows that like this is how I look. I look like I'm from the 1950s with this hair roller. So today is a national holiday. It's the emperor's birthday. So yeah, when it's the emperor's birthday, there's a day off from work. I don't usually work on Wednesdays. Sometimes I'll have auditions on Wednesday or like a shoot. I don't do my teaching job on Wednesdays. So this truly is my day off. So the plan for today is after I eat my cereal, and get dressed, which I should do kind of fast because I don't have much time. I'm going to have an italki lesson. So I'm not teaching today on italki, I'm taking my Japanese lesson. After my italki lesson, today's main agenda is uh, to go to Shibuya. So we're going to Shibuya. First, I'll like get some lunch somewhere. But next, I'm so excited. I'm actually in an exhibition, my first photo exhibition. So a photographer that I've worked with quite a few times since coming to Tokyo, uh, Yumi Gejo, she is having her solo exhibition. I'm going there today and my picture is actually the promotion for the exhibition. So there's gonna be like, pictures of me everywhere. Yeah, so I'm just gonna take you along when I go to Shibuya and the cafe and go to the exhibition. I need to get ready for my lesson. I don't have much time. Let me finish my breakfast.
キクさんすありがとうございましたありがとうございました<笑>またねバイバイバイバイ Hello everyone! So I just finished my lesson with Kiko Sensei. She's so nice. I'm gonna put a link to her profile on italki above and below. So if you're studying Japanese and you want a teacher who is going to immerse you in Japanese, I highly recommend her because in our lesson we're only speaking Japanese, she doesn't speak English. If I'm having a lesson with Kiko Sensei, like I have to explain myself in Japanese. I'm also going to put a link for you to sign up for italki. I'm not sponsored by italki. This is not like a promotion that italki is making me do because I'm an italki affiliate. So I'm an italki teacher, if you didn't know. And I'll also put a link to my teaching profile if you would like to take a lesson with me. So, basically, in the affiliate program on italki, I just share my link how I like on my social media whenever, wherever. So, you can get $10 in italki credits to learn a new language. Living in Japan, I'm very, very passionate about. Learning a new language because I have to always be studying Japanese. Italki, I think, will always be a part of my life. I take lessons on there, I teach on there. It's a great place for learning, so check it out. If you use my link, you will get $10 in italki credits after you spend $20 on italki lessons. Just to put it into perspective, my lesson, which was one whole hour with Kiko sensei this morning, was only $10. So if you sign up with my link, like that's a whole free hour lesson that you can get, which is pretty cool. So right now I'm going to answer some messages. I always have messages on my phone when I wake up. And、uh, this morning I was so preoccupied filming the day in my life thing that I did not. Answer any of them. So, I'm going to answer my messages and then I will get going to Shibuya. I'm going to a vegan cafe. My friend highly recommended it. So, I'll go there and then head over to the exhibition and see Yumi san and the photos of me. It's going to be really cool. I can't wait to show you. So, let's go.
have just ate at Two Foods. It's on the second floor of the loft building in Shibuya. It's a vegan cafe and that donut was literally the best donut I have ever had. It was yuzu and matcha flavor. It, it was just divine. I ordered a Caesar salad but they didn't have the dressing so they asked me if I wanted a different salad and the one I chose was more expensive but they didn't even charge me which was so nice. Like they didn't even charge me the difference. Yeah, really, really recommend that place. So I'm going to the exhibition now. So I have to go to the gallery. The gallery is called Gallery Miru. I'm so excited. Hello everyone! I'm just stepping out of the gallery to like get some milk tea for Yumi-san and I need something to drink too so just getting us some beverages but yeah wasn't it so pretty? I'm going back after but like I can't describe the feeling it's my first time I've seen all those photos like that I'm so proud of like on the wall and in the books and on the flyer and I just feel like really, really 
emotional. <laughs> it's so incredible and I'm so grateful I met Yumi-san. It's almost going to be like one year since I moved to Tokyo and it's been a really difficult year to be honest. But to go there and see my photos in the gallery, it just makes me so grateful and happy to be here. So yeah, I'll go get that milk tea and then I'll go back to the gallery and yeah. Ah, wow, it's such a nice day. What a lovely day off. What a lovely emperor's birthday. Happy birthday, emperor. Now today's exhibition is finished. It's uh, eight o'clock and I ended up staying the whole day. I wasn't sure if I would stay the whole time, but I really wanted to stay. So yeah, let's say hello to Yumi-san. She's been so busy. Yumi-san, how was it? Thank you. ありがとうございます。はい。今日はどうでしたか今日もたくさんのお客様に来ていただけてすごい嬉しかったです。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。よかった。嬉しい。マリエルちゃんもずっと一緒にいてくれたので心強か